Hi guys, welcome once again to The Locker, I'm your host, The Legends of Cybertron and today we have another versus video for you, but this time we have got Iron Factory's Surfing Arrow and Bear Razor taking on Magic Square's uh, Surfer and Four Wheel Drive and uh, pretty much it's Sea Spray and Beachcomber, pretty much um, I'd like to do a video with all three uh, companies um, Maybe four if Mech, Mech Fans Toys got involved, but I can't because Mech Fans Toys don't have either of these. And New Age only have Beachcomber. They don't have Sea Spray just yet. They will, but not just yet. So pretty much what this versus video is just basically what you get in the box, okay? And as you can see, you get quite a bit in each box. I would say you get more in Iron Factories than what you do in Magic Square, because Magic Square you just basically get the instructions, two guns, and these cards and two figures. Pretty much it. Iron Factories bog standard, you get a set of instructions, a set of hands, a gun, and your figure. And that's that. That's pretty much it. The boxes are pretty neat. Let's just move them to one side for a moment. The boxes are pretty much, you know... Um, as you would expect them. You know, this is your typical Iron Factory type of box where it's got like what year it came out on top. See, that's even 2021. Uh, basically, what, uh, how it looks on the back. And obviously, you know, the normal pictures on the side, etc. Okay. Magic Square, this is the old type of box, the very first ever. Uh, releases came out in this style box as you know now they've changed to you know that type of background which is I like it it's quite nice actually at least you know which year or you know which year the figures came from because we're in that style boxes but they're starting to release um old figures from with old boxes with the new box for this year and it's like uh <laughs> you know what I mean? I bought, you know, it's just the way it is. I like, I like the boxes for Mag Magic Square now. You know, as they, but I didn't really like. I like them, but they weren't very fantastic. Anyway, so in the old days, this is pretty much how Magic Square's boxes were. Now they're that on the top, that down the side, that on the old back, and that on the other side. Just basically showcasing shit: Sea Spray and Beach Corner on both the box. Now, what you actually get in the boxes? Well, in the boxes you get, obviously, an instruction book with Iron Factory. As you can see, normal type of instructions there. Now, with Beachcomber, hold on, yep, yeah, Beachcomber you get four sets of hands, and he also actually gets a set of hands with him that come on the actual figure. Uh, you basically get, you know, a couple of fists... Open palms, holding hands, you know, like holding like type of figure, uh, guns and stuff, or blasters, whatever you want to call it. Uh, and that's pretty much it. With Beach Coma, uh, not Beach, yeah, Beach Coma, you get an extra head. And as you can see, one has got a visor on, one has not. I like it without the v visor, it reminds me of G1, but you know, obviously that was. One of the other versions as well, which you could have. Uh, you also get a set of hands on with the figure. Don't get as many hands with this. You get open palms on that one and hands that obviously grip guns. So you don't really get... Yeah, you're going to get three sets of hands with that. So let's just compare these next to each other. Because this, obviously this is just a versus video, so it's just pretty much a quick video. So... There you go. There's not much height difference in them. You can say that, uh, you know, when you have, say, like Magic Square, 
I mean, it looks like Beachcomber is just slightly smaller than Sea Spray. Well, let's just take some of that dust off there, shall we? Tell how long he's been on my shelf. <laughs> so let's just stand him up straight. Let's try and stand up Beachcomber straight as well. Yeah, yeah, right. Okay, so they are pretty much the same height anyway. Give or take a, a millimetre, if that. And that's me picking. Uh, obviously, you get your sea spray and beach gum from Iron Factory are obviously the same height. Um, part of the old mini bot series. And that's pretty much it. I mean, there's not much to them um, in regards to uh, accessories that you get. Nothing like, say, I don't know, Toxic Prime. You get like all sorts. I mean, look at them. You get like all sorts of stuff with them. Um, and he points to an axe. You get all sorts of stuff with him. An axe. No, you get more than that. I'll show you in the review when I when I do it in a bit. Um, but um, yeah, that's pretty much it. It's just, I mean, I quite like uh, Iron Factory, but I also like the Magic Square version. So it's like it swings and roundabouts really. And that's pretty much it. So thanks very much for watching. Uh, if you do like my content, please like, subscribe, tell your friends about me, uh, share the video, etc. You can visit me on Instagram, Legends of Cybertron, Legends Scale Collector. Uh, or you can visit my website, LegendScaleCollector.com, which you can find a description in the description below, the link to it. Or you can go to the About Me, and you'll find all the links there. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. So thanks very much for watching. Hope to see you guys again soon. Bye for now.